Well, counting has officially begun. Electoral officials now sifting through millions of ballots. And due to a record number of pre-polling votes, a new law came into effect that allowed electoral officials to actually start sorting through votes two hours earlier than usual to try and help them get on top of things a little bit quicker. In terms of when we could see a result, well, that really does depend on how tight this race will remain. We should start to see votes trickling in very soon. If the polls are correct with Labor in the lead, we should start to see that trend emerge quite quickly. But Labor says that they are quietly optimistic. They are remaining cautious because they don't want a repeat of 2019 when the coalition was able to defy the polls to victory. If Labor does win, though, it will be the first time they will be in power in nine years. The coalition says they are still hopeful. For them to win, they have to retain all the seats they already have, as well as snag some from Labor, which is a possibility. And the narrowing polls as well as the emergence of independents and minor parties has also raised the possibility of a hung parliament. Basically the coalition and the Labor Party need 76 seats in the lower house to form government. Anything less than that they will have to negotiate with independents and minor parties to form a majority government and that could take weeks. So a number of possibilities here but the countdown has begun.